Hi you guys, uh, so today I thought I would do something a little bit different. I thought I would do um, this video just so you get to know me a little better. And yeah, let's do this. Let's uh, read 50 facts about myself. So I was born and raised in Vancouver, BC. I have three older sisters and one younger, so I'm kind of the middle child. I played basketball for 10 years. I loved it. I was in competitions and such, and I won gold at one of them, so no big deal. I suffer from anxiety, and it's not like so bad. I do get anxious, but I get anxious over the crappiest things. Just like two seconds ago, there was a spider on the floor just near me, not on me, but near me, and I had a panic attack because me and spiders still learn. About our relationship later on. Uh, I'm a paraplegic, meaning that I am paralyzed from the waist down. I was born this way and I've been in a wheelchair since I could move. I've been living on my own since I was 19, so coming up on five years, coming in December, I've known my best friend for 20 years. I am like freaked the hell out over spiders and their existence like anywhere near me I am freaking out. I went to school post-secondary um, for two semesters last year and I really enjoyed the first semester but the second I really didn't like it. My favorite sport is hockey. Uh, my favorite hockey teams are the Vancouver Canucks and the Pittsburgh Penguins. My favorite Canuck the current Canuck is Alex Burroughs, and my favorite Pittsburgh Penguin is obviously Sidney Crosby. I lost my dad to cancer when I was about 16 years old. I have three tattoos. I have this one, which you've probably seen on Instagram or something. I have this one, which says, Life is Waiting for You. It's from a band uh, called Our Lady Peace. It's their song Life and just look that song up, look at the lyrics and you'll understand why I love it. I have that one. As I've mentioned, Our Lady Peace, they are my favorite band. Obviously, favorite song is Life. I kind of mix those three facts together. Um, my favorite song of all time is literally anything by the Backstreet Boys. My favorite album is Nevermind by Nirvana. I don't understand half of it still. Half of their songs? I don't know, but it just gave me all the good feels. I have grown to love country music over the last like six or seven years. Um, like 90% of my iPod right now is country. My favorite country artist of all time has to be Miss Shania Twain, duh. My favorite Shania Twain song, it's a tie between When You Kiss Me, because that's going to be my wedding song, I don't care what my future husband says, it will be that, or Today Is Your Day, because whenever I feel down or like stressed out, I listen to that song and it just gives me this sense of relief and hope for the day, so... Good work, Shania. My favorite country song of the moment is Long Stretch of Love by Lady Antebellum. I have th two nieces, one on the way, and two nephews. I grew up with animals, like, all the time. I had two dogs growing up, uh, and then I had, like, a series of, like, little animals, hamsters, I had a mouse, I had a rat, I had a three hamsters I think. I had a bird. We were just a random household. But now my mom has two dogs, five cats, and an uncountable amount of chickens. My favorite TV show of the moment has to be The Flash and that's kind of tied into this answer. My favorite actor of the moment is Grant Gustin. One of my all-time favorite actors is Jim Carrey. My favorite movie of all time is either Grease or The Breakfast Club because those are some classics. I spent an entire summer 
which was the summer of 2009, searching for Zac Efron because he was filming in Vancouver for the movie Charlie St. Cloud. I've only been to been on three trips outside of outside of BC. I went to actually four. Now that I'm thinking about it, four. I went to Calgary to visit my aunt and uncle. I went to Mexico for my grad trip and I went to Disneyland for no reason, just to go to Disneyland. And I've been to Seattle twice, or Washington twice. So technically five. My favorite pastime has to be camping. Like I grew up camping and being on a lake, being on a boat. It's always been a great time, so love it. I am so scared of thunder and lightning. Uh, even to this day, if I'm home alone, or if I'm just walking home and I hear it, I freak out. Like, you know how the anxiety about spiders happens? This happens with thunder too. Like, it's been a thing since I was little. I don't know what it is, but it's not happening. Even thinking about it, I'm like, please don't. I shared a room with my older sister, Gabby, until I was 13 or 14 years old which got quite interesting. My favorite color is red. I hate spicy foods. Like, some now I'm getting okay with, like spicy um, tofu, greatest thing of life. But besides that, I'm just, nope, nope. I'm lactose intolerant. So I just kind of discovered that over the last few years. Um, it sucks because I love my ice cream and I love milk and I love coffee, which includes milk. So now it's like, do I soy milk and all that crap? Uh, I do not have my driver's license yet and for some 23 year olds that's a problem, but for me I'm like, whatever, we have a transit system, although it sucks, but I mean it works sometimes, so... I don't really think I'll get my license, to be honest, but I have the softest spot for McDonald's french fries. Ever since I was like five and my mom gave me my first McDonald's french fry, I've been addicted and I don't understand why. I was a vegetarian for an entire year and a bit, yeah. Um, I watched the movie um, Food Inc. and that ruined me for an entire year. I was like, nope not eating meat and I lasted an entire year and that was with my entire family not being vegetarian and me still living at home. My favorite three Disney movies because I couldn't choose just one have to be Little Mermaid, Beauty and the Beast and all the Toy Stories. My first ever crush when I was a little girl was on Nick Carter. I used to be popular in elementary school solely for the fact that I gave permission to kids to ride my wheelchair up and down the hallway around the school every lunch and recess. I tend to get emotional when people yell at me or around me. <clears throat> it stems from when I was little. I never liked loud noises. I never liked yelling. It happened quite a lot and having three sisters like three older sisters it happened on the daily let's be real here and when I got older I was a part of that so my favorite youtuber of the moment uh, has to be Superwoman because she is flawless I get to actually see her live in five days I'm so excited first ever youtuber I watched incessantly was Nerds RL. I'll put her links in the description, but she is amazing. Fellow Vancouverite, what up? Uh, my favorite show when I was growing up was Barney. He's still up there. Yep, and my thing fell, so this is going to have to do for the rest of the video. I was and still am very stubborn when it comes to anything, really. Okay. Last fun fact, I guess, <sighs> which isn't really a fun fact, but, um, rude people 
I have no tolerance for you. Like, I am nice to legitimately everyone. Unless you've been rude to one of my friends, rude to me, rude to my family. Like, we're good, you know? But as soon as you cross that line between my, me, my friends, my family, anyone I know, watch out. Okay, that's about it. Hope you enjoyed those 50 random facts. And yeah, they were random. They were See all you over guys the again tomorrow for another vlog. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments. Thumbs up this video. And I shall see you tomorrow. Peace.